Mendaki This week is SF's restaurant week My favorite ice cream ever A few months back, I ordered these keycaps from Door Factory and they finally came. They're a month late, but they're finally here. What is this for? Apparently, you gotta put these on. Here are the instructions. <laughs> it says, Always wear protection. I don't know if you can see it. it's right over here. They're actually so cute. Look at this. This is the um, popcorn ducky movies one. Ramen ducky. Two more finger. Protectors. Another one of these. And then the toxic one that has gas. Space ducky. Cute. <laughs> and then two more. The salad is actually going to Alfred. Really cute. The salad ducky. Is it in focus? And then my wave ducky. These were around like. Okay, these are not the cheapest. I don't remember how much they were, but I know buying a whole set together it was $300. It was cheaper to buy it like this than it would individually. So that's that. I'm gonna pop it out and put it onto my keyboard. Right now we're trying to decide where we want to put each of the keys. And we have four, no, we have five. I might just do an order, one, two, like that. Once I put it on this side. Maybe I'll do one, two. One, two, three. Ooh, should I do that? So we're gonna have to pop these out. Two. Equal. Minus. That's gonna be one that I'll have to remember. I have a popcorn one over here. I have the ramen one. I also have my game key right over here. I think it's made out of like aluminum. I'm, mm, I don't remember. I got that a while ago. And then we have this space one and this gas one. And then there's this wave one. And I honestly thought that I would like this one the gas one more than i thought i would because this one's the one that i liked upon seeing like the set but the fact that the gas kind of looks like lettuce is throwing me off and it's like not in the right tones so that's that This vlog is a vlog that I'm going to be uploading for the first time in like two and a half months. Because I feel like the past month or two, we've done a lot, but we've done a lot of the same things. So I was like, instead of making each of them into 
their own little like sections. I could just add little clips, right? Yeah, like a little montage. Yeah, so recap, what did we do a lot of? We bought a lot of beer. Yeah. Tried a lot of beer because this grocery store opened up and their beer selection was like huge and it changes almost every time. Mm. I usually do not like IPAs because they're a little too piney for my taste, but I'm down to try it still. Not my preference, but I'll still try it. We're gonna try this out of the can since we don't have a cup to pour it in. Ooh, you smell it? Upon first smell, pine. <laughs> Is why Kiwi be friends? Same is a Laughing Monk Brewing Company. It's a sour. It's good. So we're gonna try this one now and see how it tastes. A little bit piney, but not that bad. Still a bit enjoyable for me, but definitely borderline. This I think this is my pine limit. That's why they call it hoppy lager. I thought you said I'd be fine with hoppy. <laughs> you lie. <laughs> Cheers to the bears. I think we're getting into a weird area. Oh, look, it's only three glasses. It's less than the others. I think the same size. It should be. Whoa, was well, not what I was expecting. Cause it still has that piney taste. At first, and then you can't really taste it. But not bad. Yeah, I think so this, like... well, the color, the red and blue bear is my first, the Pilsner is still my first. And then this is my second. This one should be a good one. That's quite good. Stuff. You're right. And orange this one, peel. Mm, not so sure. <laughs> rip off, rip <laughs> off, rip <laughs> off. <laughs> Hear this? There's still stuff stuck in, I mean, stuff in there, but this couldn't even fill three glasses. We have to blur that out. <laughs> uh oh. Very aromatic. I don't think you'll like it. You can taste the coriander. <laughs> I think we're getting a little weird here. Yeah, it seems like cheesy though. Wait, this is medicine. We finally managed to get the Holy Ghost one. Exciting, it's a Pilsner from The Laughing Monk as well. And we got Sister Dorothy. It comes in like a red can. Is this glittery? Yeah. Red glittery can. And on the bottom, this says, no place like home. I think, yes. Yes, it says no place like home. So, very cute packaging. Sucker for packaging. Lighter than the rest of the bears that we got. Mm -hmm. Go. This one's less bitter at the end. I'm kind of bitter in the beginning. But the beginning tastes like huh. very golden nail polish. Dorothy tastes like glitter. I told you, this is a West Coast IPA. 
And then what else? Oh, we tried HelloFresh. Yeah. Fried tilapia was good. And we also got risotto out of the two. I think we preferred the fried tilapia better. All right, so this is how the risotto turned out. It doesn't look as appealing on camera, but it looks nice in real life. Mm. I'm a fan. Mm. Nice I feel like it's not too heavy. So fried tilapia, salad, and potato. Two I. Mm -hmm. Gonna add some. Yes, and also came with sauce that you can make which looks like this which we tried and it looks i mean and it tasted pretty good okay guys which one do we want to try first let's do acai first okay yeah. okay ready i'm gonna pour oh a little side note i'm also not really a big fan of kombucha i just don't like the idea of it Hmm. Very light, not as sour as I thought it would be. Mm -hmm. It's like sour in the beginning, but the aftertaste is not. Yeah. Aftertaste I is nothing crazy. Feel like recommend actually. It's less sour than real kombucha. Mmm. <laughs> Crispy. Yeah, I'm just surprised. No, it's good for me. I think. Yeah. I feel like the sauce pulls it together for me. The sauce has flavor. The sauce is so yummy. It is. Sniff, sniff. Oh, Smells like sour. Sure. It tastes like a peach lemonade rather than a strawberry lemonade. What's that aftertaste? Does it taste kind of malty? I think out of the two, my favorite is this one. It smells like. I guess it's good because they give you all the ingredients. You don't have to shop for anything. And then Alicia and I also got both our COVID vaccines. Hooray, hooray. Caroline got one. The second one is soon. And after Caroline gets hers, our whole family, not her family, my family and Alicia's family will be fully vaccinated. Okay, so where we're going right now is it's currently San Francisco's restaurant week. Is it like an SF thing or is it? What? It's a lot this week it's SF. This week is SF's restaurant week and we're going to a place called the Vault Garden. And would you like to tell them a little bit about restaurant week or your experience? Uh, it's my first restaurant week. I've never tried yeah. anything. She got, went last year. I don't know if you went any prior years. I did that. go the year prior as well. <laughs> um, so essentially it's um, a week to showcase some of San Francisco's restaurants. They have these like uh, fixed price meals, uh, lunch, dinner that they offer. And uh, it's sort of like, like I said, to showcase like, the, the restaurants. So to get their names out there or something? Sort or of. Um, more noticed? There are ones that are already like pre-established already. Um, and then there are like the smaller ones that oh, that uh, might oh. meet this as a promotional thing. But they there are established restaurants, like maybe this one. This, this it looked like pretty good. Restaurant. Of course, it's a fixed menu, but we did choose a place where we'll each get to get like yeah, different things so we can all share and try it. Yeah. Whereas like a lot of some other places, it was just like maybe one dish per place or like, what is it? An appetizer, an entree, and maybe like a dessert or a drink or something. So I feel like this one was a good choice. So that's gonna be exciting. It is outdoor seating. They didn't do takeout. So we were planning to do takeout, but we're not gonna do that today. We're running a little late. We made a reservation last night online for 1 o'clock and it's currently 12.36. Oh, I also got a bike, which Carol and I built. Because we're supposed to go start Partially. biking soon. Partially, well we put it together, but we just have to get it like safety checked. I think we're getting into a weird area. Oh, I thought you choked on your spit. Yes, yeah, so we have to get it safety checked and then we're gonna go biking because spring is here and it's supposed to get sunny soon i'm assuming even though it's not that sunny today also forgot to mention that this is like my first time eating out at a restaurant in like half a year is it what's last what fish place oh yeah so we just parked in the parking lot in like chinatown and we're just walking there now Little 
of chili, but there's fire here, and there was a little mishap. Turns out there's no lunch for restaurant we care, which is like a total mistake on their website. Unfortunate. I guess I will still not experience SF Restaurant Week this year. <laughs> Maybe in 2022. It ends on the 18th, so you can't still hand. So uh, that's in just tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> but the food still looks good. Just very limiting for the menu. We got the vault burger, some kind of scramble, beignets. That looks really good. It smells really good. What is this called? Parana. to the ferry building. Managed to get a spot. We're gonna walk through the ferry building now too. See what goodies are inside. Maybe get some oysters. Okay, we just got Humphreys from the ferry building. I got a secret breakfast. Alicia got something that she thinks might be curry ice it cream. It might be curry ice cream. I might have made a mistake. <laughs> and then Caroline got a uh, spice, wait, peanut candy with spiced chocolate. This is the questionable one. I thought it was going to be chocolate. Okay. <laughs> Secret Breakfast is always safe. Sure if you come to Humphreys, I recommend Secret Breakfast. Taste it. Okay, go. Okay, I'm not going to give any reaction. I'm not going to give it away. Yeah. And then I'll have you guys try it. Okay. I know what mine is. Go, go, go. Her face should be a dead giveaway. It's crazy. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> well, mine should go well with yours. Is it? <laughs> it does remind me well, of when it's not curry, it's not. we went to Gilroy Garlic uh, Festival <laughs> and we ate the garlic ice cream and it was kind of unpleasant. This gives this me the same vibes. My favorite ice cream ever. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I was finna write a song, but I've been hella stressed. But I looked in your eyes and noticed I'm hella blessed. Staring at you on the set plane, I ain't worried about nothing. Cause you got me feeling like the Wayne Wade in 03. Yeah, you and me, we got the heat. So bump all that anxiety. But you hit to the side of me. I feel like I'm gliding. And honestly, look, I don't want you saying that you had a better chance without me. That you wish you had made plans without me. Yeah. 